day two of the Wyoming High School State Track and Field Meet. Let's get right to it. 4A boys, 800 meter run. This is what everyone was talking about. Ricky Four of Rock Springs, a new overall record, one minute, 48.14 seconds. He beat his old record set two years ago by three and a half seconds. 1A girls, 800 meter run. Kaylee Greenwald of Lingelfort Laramie in the red versus Kaylee Moise of Cokeville in the black. Greenwald would turn on the afterburners in the final stretch and prove she wanted it a little bit more. Two minutes, 22.41 seconds. That's all we could do race-wise because there were a lot of field events going on at the same time. For a girl shot put, this is mainly a crouch of Rock Springs, giving it the heave ho for a distance of 44 feet, nine and one quarter inches. She was only one of two throwers to get across the 40 foot line and she went further for the win. 2A boy shot put, Martin Fitzwater of Lusk. He got all of this throw and the crowd knew it as well. 58 feet, five and one quarter inches. That's a new school record and he's a junior. So he can try for the 2A record next year, which he only missed by three feet. 3A boys discus, Garrett Lynch of Powell. He makes a metal disc look like a Frisbee. 173 feet, 11 inches. He knows he has it won. The next closest thrower was 16 feet behind him. 2A girls discus, Casey O'Connor of Sundance. She has a pretty good arm, 149 feet, eight inches. Her teammate was the next closest thrower and she was 30 feet back. This competition was not even close. 2A boys triple jump. This is Tyler Cornwell of Thermopolis and a one, two and three to cover a distance of 43 feet, three and a half inches. He had about half a foot to spare for the first place medal. 4A boys triple jump. Robert Krager of Natrona, he'll hop, skip, and jump his way for a distance of 44 feet, 11 inches. Jumping is one of his specialties, and he was a competitor in the next event. 4A boys high jump. Marcus Nolan of Kelly Walsh, up and over 6 feet, 2 inches. Krager got over as well, but Nolan did it in one try, and thus he had control of the tiebreaker for the win. 3A girls high jump. Ann Wingleth of Lyman, five feet, six inches. She gave the 3A record a scare, but could not quite make it. She has another year to go though, so look out. Finally, the 4A girls long jump. Jerea Davis of Kelly Walsh, thinking about the Southern California sand and beaches, 18 feet, seven and three quarter inches. She's got speed and she'll use it on the final day of competition.